So let's move on. Because you know, being sexually harassed somewhere. Oh, we need to save. So let's do it. She's there in crime. I can't believe we couldn't get arena tickets for this match. Now we'll have to watch the duel on the view screen. Who cares? It's Duncan and Girl on Fire. It's not like we're gonna miss anything good. Shh, they're about to start. So quit complaining and just watch the view screen. Ladies and gentlemen, I draw your attention to the dueling ring. Here, two combatants will battle for your viewing and gambling enjoyment. Now, I hope all your bets are down because we're ready to roll. In this corner, I give you Girl on Two Fingers. And over here, looking to climb the ranks yet again, is the ever persistent Dead Eye Duncan. <laughs> and to nobody's great surprise, Dead Eye is down again. Don't worry, folks, he's just unconscious. As usual, our medics will have him up and about in a bit. Well, that was quick, wasn't it? So I give you the winner, Gerlon Twofinger. Is there anything more exciting than a woman who's armed and dangerous? Twitch is my favorite. He's wild. Twitch! Twitch! <laughs> Oscar, What are you looking at? Fresh meat? You want a piece of me? You want to step in the dueling chambers with me? Big talk. Go speak with the hut in the corner to back it up. He's the duel organizer. I'll look forward to our match. Fresh meat is just what I need to end my losing streak. I haven't seen you around here before. You looking to step into the duel ring? Or did you just come to watch? Yes, I was eating. You don't know hungry. What? Why are you here if you don't even know what the dueling ring is? I don't have time to answer your questions. I need to stay focused for my next match. Maybe Azure can help you out. He's the hut over there in the corner. He arranges all the duels. Hello there, off -world. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Marl. I'm one of the duelists here at the cantina. I was wondering when you'd get around to talking to me. I'm, uh, uh, how are you? No, we've never met. It's just that most people who come here to watch the duels are bored nobles, looking for a little excitement in their drab lives. But you're different. You look like you know a thing or two about combat. I'm guessing you didn't come here to sit on the sidelines and watch a duel. Are you looking for a match? I... Yeah. My area of expertise is pretty much limited to the dueling ring and the other combatants here at the cantina. But I'll try to answer any questions you might have. You've come to the right man. I've been dueling here for nearly 20 years, and I remember every duelist who's been through this cantina. Of course, there are only five of us left now. Duncan, Gerlon, Ice, Twitch, and me. Bendak's Starkiller comes in once in a while. 
He's retired now. Duncan, worst duelist ever. His nickname is Deadeye because he fights like he's blind. I wouldn't worry about him. Gerlon used to be pretty good before the accident. His blaster overheated during a match and exploded. One in a million occurrence. Paralyzed three fingers on his right hand. They call him Gerlon Two Fingers now. He hasn't been the same since the accident. But he's still out here trying to earn a living. That's why I never fight with blasters. Ice? Well, she's not much for personality. But she's a hell of a fighter. Confident, steady. Popular with the crowd, too. If you rub against her, you know you're in for a tough match. Twitch? I think that Rodian is completely crazy. But he's very, very good despite his insanity. Or maybe because of it. Even I can't beat him. Me? Oh, I've seen my share of battles. My best years are gone. But I can still hold my own against anyone in here. Except maybe Twitch. What can I say? Bendak was a legend. Never lost a match his entire career. But he was bloodthirsty as an Iridorian battle rager. Never liked having to face the same opponent twice. Got so he wouldn't battle anyone unless it was a death match. When they made death matches illegal, he went into retirement. He still hangs around here sometimes. Bendak's the best there ever was. Plain and simple. Even now, I bet that anyone who steps into the ring with him wouldn't make it out alive. My area of expertise... Only what I heard from the news reports, which are all censored by the Sith. Some pods crashed into the Undercity. Anyone caught harboring survivors will be arrested and executed. Really, I, I don't think it's any of my business. The Sith want to call themselves rulers of Taurus? It's fine by me, just so long as they don't shut the duel ring down. Exactly my thinking. I can only tell you what is recorded in the basic visitor guides. The Upper City is a beautiful destination where intergalactic travelers can find all their basic needs. If you're looking for excitement, the duel rings here are your best bet. Stay out of the Lower City. It's nothing but a gang-ridden slum. Is there anything else you want to know? Goodbye, stranger. Stop the ice. I know what you're going to say. I'm so beautiful, I'm so attractive. How can someone who looks so hot with a weapon in her hand be called Ice? Well, I've heard it all before. I'm here to take care of business in the dueling ring, not to have some slack-jawed, goggled-eyed man slobber all over me. So back off. Show my sword. Now you know why they call me Ice. If you're looking for a match, go talk to Azure. He's that big hut over there in the corner. Otherwise, just go away. Go away. I don't know what's going on. Fucking dead body. Stab in the back. That's cool. Fibro blades and blasters, and nobody ever dies. How come I get the feeling you're trying to take us for a ride? Maybe I can level up a little bit and come back here. Sweet thing, huh?
Let's try to level up a little bit. I'm sorry, I'm too busy to talk. I've got to get these drink orders to the customers. Where did you get those clothes? A trash compactor in the lower city? And where are those drinks we ordered? Why is the help here so incompetent? One word from Daddy and I could get you fired. That's better. Now, hurry up with our order. And here are your drinks, Miss Levin. I apologize for the delay. Don't bother me. I don't speak to the help. Do I know you? No? Then why are you speaking to me? This cantina isn't the fanciest joint I've ever been in, but it's a good place to unwind after a hard shift at the military base. Um, more generic. No hard feelings, my good man, but I can't really talk with you right now. It's difficult enough to draw the interest of the ladies in this establishment as it is. Surely you understand what I'm talking about. I guess you've experienced many lonely evenings, something I'm hoping to avoid tonight. Check out those Twi'lek dancers. I don't know who designed their outfits, but that man deserves a raise. Mucha shakapaka. You keep... What? Why are you speaking to me? Can't you tell from my clothing that I'm of the nobility? What do I, tell? I can't be seen talking with a common rabble. It wouldn't be proper for a man of my standing. Um, I... Don't bother me, I don't. Leave me alone. I'm not giving out any auto pricks to my fans today. What? You don't recognize me? I'm Bendix Starkiller, the most famous blaster slinger on Tarth.